Welcome, I'm Mike Shatwright. Today we'll be covering news from the 25th of September 2022 to October the 2nd, 2022. Alright, <coughs> so, uh, so, uh, so let, let's get started. First of all, I'm going to continue on with a some additional information about uh, something that was announced last week. It was Fleet Week. Fleet Week was not, it's not don't been created but it's not a Star Trek Online created thing this is a this is not this is a this is in partnership with a half dozen other big com half dozen companies related within who are using Star Trek, Star Trek IP there'll be quite, as I said there'll be quite a few people who are related to the Star Trek Online uh, Online uh, and not just just online people, and there's also some just people who work with it within Star Trek itself. So you'll be so so there'll be stuff for everyone, and and I'll be I'll be new, and it's be starting on the on the fifteenth late later this month. And there might be some there will be some Star Trek online news within that lot, and I'll cover the bit when I can when I when it comes out. All right. First of all, this <laughs> the finished price pack has returned. It's on on PC. Um, it's on Monday. It's supposed to be from the twenty ninth of September to the sixth of October. You can, uh, and you and the as since this free price pack is uh, is also available. As this free price pack is available. Uh, they are also including the experimental ship upgrade tokens as as the a limited time in the list in the star. So if you have five ultra rare tokens, you can get 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 an experimental ship upgrade. Twenty very rare tokens, you get get one. Or hundred rare, rare tokens, you can get it. And it it's all depends on stuff. And there's parts of I've covered this before in the past, but. There's a few additions here, but most of them are have been are not have been have been around for quite a while, and I still recommend the Plesh the and the and the Bajonium Scepter, being Plesh Trial Raider. I've been there's two things I would re recommend out of this. But then also this week is on the tw on the twenty eighth week. The amounts that that the tw twin out to the third is going to be an upgrade weekend, which is pretty much the best time to get the upgrade because you'll be doing the upgrade with a with a, with usually with finished upgrade tokens, and you can get a couple a few of them there as well at this time. That's all the news news this week, and the PC patch notes uh, for for the tw twin night for uh, of September. We updated the they updated the uh, mineral plaque to include Louis Fletcher, aka Kai Wynn, uh, since she passed away l over a week ago. Resolved quite a few issues revolving revolving and David points in progress. Uh, in in uh, in the involved in involved a text issue related to the device slots on the. Career Pilots Reward Pack. Results an issue presenting Debbie Screen Universal Console interacting with uh, effects from entry. Uh, basically made Debbie Screen uh, Universal Console work with with unconventional systems, which is a very nice thing. The, the Debbie Screen Universal Console now has a 60 second minimum cooldown. It was Forms of extreme defense abilities. This is because the uh, intrepid ability of armor, car face, face shift, and metaphysic shielding. This might be this is more of a PvP ch change, and well, it makes you most of these make you near impossible to kill. Uh, updated the infiltrated, so you now can actually have the superior and basic stack with it uh, with the. Inf Thing. It does mean that you now can cloak. Your cloaking ships can 
has to do a lot more damage. It's going to do a lot more damage for longer. It's a bizarre day issue where goes into some in 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 the in the captain's table. Yeah, yeah. Well, because some of them had a ridiculously long uh, name, which was stupid, <laughs> and after some of the captains just had wrong names, they took completely. And added the added the two lockbox ships, which is the Thai Red Dot Warbird and the Vag Vags Vagis Temple Red the Heavy Red Warbird to the ships compatible with the Roman drone ship Hangar Pets. The Thai is more of the is the basically the Roman the 21st century the tw no 21st century version of the red red note which looks like it's based it's a it's a Tira style Diderot Dex as I, I like as I think it is and the Valkish uh, every dreadnought is the is a big big heavy ship. Uh, which is which is not which is ma which is released on the side alongside the J, but and um, that's really the patch notes for the week, I uh, and that's actually all the all the uh, stuff for, for, from from PC this week, and um, on Wednesday back on Wednesday, they they announced that the Abbey will be happening this weekend from the Abbey bonus event from the 29th to the 13th. So that's a couple of weeks, and you'll be able. To, and it's very nice to get hold to boost up your to boost stuff up, so you can actually get some of those traits done. Uh, your traits, the the your temporal recruit uh, missions done faster because you get double XP campaign XP for that. Very nice, very nice. And there's a 30% bonus stand and a 50% mod cell and. Well, there's good, but that's from the 29th to the 3rd. So basically, you got until tomorrow. <laughs> and all almost all bundles have, uh, have appeared. So you, and but, I won't I won't go into what you can pick and what you can't. But it's very nice to choose. And but the remaining two uh, items on my list, and for for this. Uh, for 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 this time, this is. By the way, this be Mike Shirt Writer. See you guys next time.